Legends, welcome back to another episode of where I test every single vehicle that I can find in Revolt. The vehicle I'm testing today is Sprinter XL. Alrighty, so Sprinter XL is a electric class vehicle. It has a rookie rating. The speed is eh, not very quick, but it's okay. You know, acceleration is amazing. And the weight is super light. So you can expect some good things from this or a dangerous concoction that will cause you to lose a lot of control on a certain map. <coughs> Supermarket. <coughs> what? Okay. Four wheel drive. Um, I think this vehicle has the highest acceleration rate of all of the vehicles that we've tested thus far. Yeah, definitely. And I think it's most certainly the lightest. Yeah, definitely. Uh, but the speed... It seems like Colonel Moss is still the one with the highest top speed. Yeah. Okay. Or, yeah, that's it, definitely. Okay, but let's see how it stacks up against the rest of the vehicles. So this is Museum 1, Junior RC mode. Um, off the bat, a little bit of heavy steering, but once it's turning, it turns very well. Nice. You can feel it's light on the rear. This looks a bit like a, a uh, Mazda MX-5, doesn't it? And it also reminds you a little bit of Aquasonic. We'll get to that vehicle soon. Let's see. Oh! Now, because it's so light, any weapon <laughs> it reacts to extremely badly. You see that? So. It's a bummer that that. Uh, I can't remember. It's called Shockwave. Um, Shockwave. Um, the length in the Steam version of the game has been shortened. So, yeah, it's not amazing. Usually with a shockwave you could really go for long distances. Okay, ooh, wait, we don't want that. I'd rather have Vulcan receive that. Okay. Man, it's a celebration for sure. Now, I'll show you the problem with this vehicle, so maybe it'll show itself here around this corner. No. It seems like we need to have it in simulation mode before that problem shows up. But yeah, as you can see, it's a quick vehicle. When it wants to, it rocks. It is a nice looking vehicle, you know. It's the only vehicle that I know of that has a checkered flag used as a vinyl. <laughs> nice. So far so good, I'm going to just bail and take that part out, just in case I can't make the jump. I'm sure I would have made the jump, but it doesn't turn that well. Nice and wide wheels. Now the interesting thing is this vehicle feels quite a bit like a front wheel drive. So I just want to double check that again, I might have missed it. Is it front wheel drive or all wheel drive? Or four wheel drive, you know? 
Okay, let's use the shock now. Here we are. Nice. Didn't want to get in the way of that slug. <laughs> you see how the vehicle reacts. It's but then again, it doesn't understeer, so... Well, it understeers a little, but it's not, not that bad. It feels really good. And then we celebrate. Nice. Okay, 414. 414.053. Brilliant. Alrighty, so... It's not the fastest. Um, it would seem that Dr. Grudge is still the quickest here. Okay. Now, let's, oops, let's see what it does in simulation mode. Then I'll show you the problem that I have with this vehicle. Um, if it shows us the problem. Nice. Oh, I didn't check what, what wheel drive it is. We'll just have to check in the beginning of the video. <laughs> Sorry about that. Don't want to waste your time. Come on. There's a bomb. Ooh. Reminds me of Counter Strike, you know? He's got, He's got the bomb. The bomb has been planted. Ready to go. Come on. Oh. Nah, you see. So there's a little there's a point where it does that. And then it starts drifting. And then it goes all sporadic. It could just be me being not a good driver. And it understeers now. And then when you if you're not careful, it just suddenly oversteers, like whoops. Not whoops, but that was a whoops. Anyway, whatever. <laughs> not gonna use the speed boost here. Give it that turn, and that bottom turn. Oh, you see that? That's the problem I have with it. Once it starts drifting, it just keeps on drifting. And it's, you have to, like, stop the vehicle get it out of that drift. Check, let's see if we can just come on. Oh boy. We got a boost there but lost control. Let's see. Let's get him, let's get him. Yes! We were lucky there. Come on. Come on, come on. Come on! Oh boy. Yeah, that whip. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. No! This thing likes poles for some reason, eh? Oh, that guy's got me honed in. That was close. Colonel Moss is not happy. Let's see if we can get him back. Give him something good. Yeah, did it work? No, it didn't. Oh, that's it. You see, that's what I was talking about. As well. Come on. What? Come on. Come on! What are you talking about? Do you see that? Ah. Can we catch up to Vulcan? Come on, come on. Come on. Oh, yeah, come on. Hopefully Vulcan makes a mistake. 
Nope, we made a mistake and Vulcan takes the cake. Well, let we celebrate anyway. Alright, <laughs> so we did a 354. 354.660. Alrighty. Not the fastest car here. Um, it would seem to be that this is the second to last. Um, like the second slowest vehicle. Um, second to last slowest vehicle. No, it is the slowest, second slowest vehicle. There we go. Brain. Why aren't you braining? Anyway, well, there you go. Like the video if you liked it. <laughs> and, uh,. Yeah, comment below your thoughts on this vehicle and what you like about it and what don't you like about it. And um, yeah, do you mind me rambling on like a crazy passion passionate kid? <laughs> um, yeah, comment your thoughts below and uh, yeah, see you in the next video. Please subscribe to the channel if you want to support it, that'd be awesome. Um, yeah, take care, see you in the next one. Peace.